to determine number of moles if you are given mass you divide it by the molar mass then you'll be able to retrieve number of moles of the substance now the mass it has to be in grams what if it is not given in grams now for mass the common units that we deal with are tons kilograms and grams so to convert the mass from tons to kg what we need to do is multiply by a thousand if we convert from kg to grams what we need to do is multiply by another thousand right so if we are to convert directly from tons to grams we will just need to multiply thousand thousand which is multiply a million what about the other way around we have the mass in grams and what if we need to convert it into another units okay so from grams to kg we'll just need to divide by a thousand from kg to tons we'll just need to divide by another thousand okay so from grams to tons we divide by a thousand thousand which is divide by a million Let's have a quick recap on unit conversion for volume. Now in chemical calculations, you may deal with three types of units, okay, which is meter cube, dm cube, and cm cube. From meter cube to dm cube, what we need to do is multiply by a thousand. From dm cube to cm cube, we need to multiply by another thousand. So if we were to convert meter cube to cm cube directly, we will need to multiply by a thousand thousand, which is a million. What about the other way around? If we are given a substance in terms of cm cube and we want to convert it into dm cube, we can divide by a thousand. If we are to convert from dm cube to meter cube, we can divide by another thousand. Now if we are to convert from cm cube directly to meter cube, we divide by a thousand thousand, which is divide by a million. Now, if you find this video useful, please share with your friends. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. If you'd like to have more chemistry resources, do check out my website. The link is in the description below. Have fun learning chemistry and I will see you soon.